Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to talk to you about my Synology. Synology? Syn Synology. Syn NAS server, which is the DS918 Plus model. I've had it about a year now and I use it for my time machine backups, extra storage space, as well as my Plex server. Um, but unfortunately, after running it for a couple of months, it started to make this noise. Now normally it should be like this when it's not under load. And obviously when it is under load it sounds like this. Unfortunately it is going to be loud under load with four mechanical hard drives running away but I definitely want to fix that annoying buzzing vibration sound and today I'm going to show you how. First things first you want to go online somewhere like Amazon and get yourself some velcro. You don't need a lot so like the 2.5 meter one should be a plenty which is only like five quid so it's very cheap and there should be plenty for this project. Now before you do anything with the hardware make sure you go onto the dashboard and shut down the system correctly. Once all the lights are off and it's fully shut down we can go ahead and remove it and disconnect all the cables from the back. This might also be the perfect opportunity for you to clean and remove some of the dust on the hardware. I've had mine running solidly, you know, 24 seven every single day for about a year now. So it has collected quite a lot of dust, even though the room is fairly clean in general. But as you can see, all the intakes, all the grills and everything has got a lot of dust in them. So it's probably the best idea to give it a quick clean in this stage. Although the cleaning stage might be optional, I do absolutely recommend that you put some labels on the drive before you remove them because the sequence has to be in the exact same order that you remove them in when you put them back in. Otherwise, you could corrupt the data on your server. Here's the Velcro strip that we're gonna be using. We don't actually need this side with the little hooks on it. We only need the soft side. I use the side of the hard drive cage to measure the length I need to cut the strip. Cut the strip to length using some scissors and we're going to make sure that the surface is nice and clean before we peel the back of the velcro and just stick it on. So at this stage I took one of the drives and tried to put it back in to make sure it still goes in correctly and it does. It's quite tight but it does go in without using much force but now it sits nice and tight in there so hopefully it should fix the vibration sound. Simply repeat the steps as before and do it for the other three drive bays and we're good to go. That's it, super quick and easy. And all we gotta do is put the drives back into the correct sequence as mentioned before. And I do recommend locking it using the little key because that will stop you from accidentally pulling the hard drives out uh, just as, as an extra security. So that's what I'll do. Now all we got to do is plug all the cables back in, but I also took this opportunity to clean the surrounding surface a bit because it was quite dusty. Once it's up and running, I went back into the dashboard just to make sure there was no error. And I also did a manual scrubbing process just to be absolutely sure that the drives and volumes are intact and nothing has changed. So the big question is, did it work? Well, I've been running it for over a month now since I've applied the Velcro to try and fix it and I'm happy to report I've not heard it make that stupid vibration sound ever since. So yes, the answer is yes, it did work. And as you saw, it's very easy to do, it's very cheap, and you get to sort of clean out your drives at the same time. Clean out your drive, that sounds a bit wrong, doesn't it? So yeah, as you can see, it's a very easy, quick fix. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Hopefully you found it helpful and useful in some way. Uh, yeah, I will see you guys next time. Bye. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to talk to you about my Synology. 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 I can't say the word. Oh, what the hell? I can't say that word for some reason.